This is Cole with A1 Discount Satellite, the satellite man here today. I'm just going to teach you how to program a 40.0 hopper remote control to an existing hopper. So first of all, we're going to get our new 40.0 remote control in the mail or purchase it from an authorized retailer. Once we have the remote control, we're going to go home, we're going to go to our hopper receiver. At the front of our hopper receiver, we're going to flip down the flip down menu. We're going to hit the menu button twice which is going to bring up this wonderful gray screen that we have on the screen now. Once this comes up, here in the top corner, it says that there's no remote controls connected to your device. To link it, it says to press the SAT button. On the new 40.0 remote control that you just purchased, we're going to push the SAT button until it lights up. Once it lights up, you're going to hear a beep, and then it's going to come back here, and it's going to tell you that it's paired. It's going to tell you your battery strength, and it's going to tell you that everything's okay. Now that we've got our brand new 40.0 remote control, we're going to have to program it to our TV. So to do this, we're going to hit the cancel button to get us out of the screen. Then we're going to go and hit the yellow short key button to get us into the settings. Go to remote manager, hit the select button. Once we've gotten into the screen, we're going to go to TV code by hitting the select button. We're going to go to lookup code, and then from there we're going to find our TV. Our brand is an LG. Once you find your brand, you're going to hit next by pressing the select button. It's going to take a few seconds for this to happen. Once this comes up, we're going to try our volume key. Once the volume works, we know that we found the right code and we can hit select, which is yes. We want to save the changes. And now your remote control can control your TV. It's as simple as that.